They call it the City of Angels. Funny, in my 30 years here, I haven't seen a single one. What happened to Henry was a true crime. And if there's one man who deserves to find out the truth, it's his son. This is his story. Nick King as a character is, is an ex-cop who, who's known for his uh, not-so-subtle ways. You picked the wrong party to crash, jackass. Here comes a lead enema. Nick's dad was a cop, and uh, they don't know exactly where, where he is at this point. You know, Nick wasn't very happy about his upbringing in Hong Kong because he was effectively, you know, a half-breed in Hong Kong. You know, he's half American, half Chinese, and, and now he's back in L.A. where, you know, it's totally accepted. But there, he was shunned and had to fight for his, for his independence. Growing up as an orphan would screw with anybody's head. Come on, everyone's had it tough. So what? Nah, not like Nick. First, his mother died. She was a dear soul. Then, his father, Henry, got fingered in a drug trafficking scandal and simply disappeared. But Nick uh, comes back from suspension. He's brought back uh, to uh, take a job at this new EOD division, which is a special unit uh, um, which has been set up to sort of tackle the most difficult and toughest cases in the city. Trouble is brewing in Chinatown, and he's being brought back to, uh, to take care of it. Well, Nick is designed after the quintessential Hong Kong Hollywood action character. He's a very traditional, no-nonsense kind of cop. Step away from the barkeep. You have a death wish? I'm gonna make you scream like a cat in heat. Obviously, he has no patience with politics and things like that, and that's bound to get a guy in trouble. You know, even when authority is telling him to do it this way, he just says, well, as long as the objective is accomplished. Hey, Chief, who's the suit? Nick, this is uh, Agent in Charge Masterson from the uh, FBI. <clears throat> Seems that they had the spa under surveillance when you... Uh... When you poured your John Wayne stunt and blew it all to hell. We've been working on this for weeks, Ken. Sorry, sitting around stuffy vans eating donuts cramps my style. You want this Rocky? Let me show this around and see if I get any takers. You telling me you know someone who can ID this guy? Maybe. An arms dealer out in Venice Beach, a real piece of work. Done business with Russians for years. If there's trouble, then he's in it. Whoa, whoa, pal. I'm running this up now, and you don't so much as take a leak unless I say so. Speaking of which, Masterson, your fly's open. <gasps> Nick is not really a traditional video game hero. I think um, he's got a sense of seriousness, but at the same time, lightheartedness that, about him that, that I think people like. He has a love relationship with all women in the game. He wants to be a player, but he's not. And he comes in guns a-blazing and then says, hey, how you doing? And it just doesn't work. Hey, Rosie, say hello to the poster child against inbreeding, Jimmy Fu. And I suppose that would make you the poster child for anger management? He's not just a rogue, uh, wild cop. He, can, he also has his, his family side. He, just, he has his brother in the game. Going into retirement. Leave my brother out of this. Nick has a wide assortment of cool toys. He has very fast cars. Players will want to be Nick because he's uh, extremely athletic. He can drive fast. He can, uh, he can do things that people can only wish to do when they're, they're in a bad situation. 